Okay, I'll go ahead and get started. Uh, I just want to open it up by uh, thanking uh, Wofford for their uh, hospitality and the Panthers this week. It's been a great week for us. Got in a lot of good work down there and then here tonight finishing it off. Um, Andy Kaya in particular uh, down there that, that does a great job for Wofford and, and uh, helped us out a lot this week. So with that, I'll open up to your questions. Yeah, I, th I thought it was, Sal. Um, you know, it was still a lot of work to do, but I thought we grew as a team, uh, both on the field and off the field, and that was the goal. And, um, you know, again, a lot of work remains, uh, way too many penalties tonight in the second half in particular, and, uh, but things we can learn from. Um, so it's, it's, uh, it's a time for us to continue to grow and learn. John, you mentioned last week about how uh, Josh was really maybe too hyped up uh, for when he first got out there and kind of showed him how he played. This looked like a more, at least from above, a composed guy in the decisions he made, crisp throws. What were your observations of what you saw in those two series? Yeah, I would, I would echo that, um, Vic. He, he did look um, like the game slowed down this week a little bit for him, and uh, that's good to see. It's a, you know, again, I've said this before, whether it's a quarterback in this case or another position, a, a young player that you, that continues to grow and, and the game slows down for him is, is a good thing. Yeah, I mean that's we've got to we've got to um, you know take what the defense gives us in, in terms of whether it's matchups or scheme and um, and so that was you know that that continues to show Josh's development. It comes from his hard work. You know he's he's been working hard. Um, Matt also I thought had a good night and um, so that's you know when you practice a certain way you know those habits transfer at times over to the game. John, can you I mean, obviously you just give us your impression of this kid? You know he's got the opportunity. He's done a good job. He really has. Um, you know, I thought the one thing we noticed early on was that he's he's good in a lot of areas. You know, and, it, and he's smart, tough. Um, and, and tonight, I, uh, you know, he caught the ball well, and um, you know, it was it was good to see again another young player do some good things for us. And um, we moved the ball. I thought well offensively early on, in particular. Yeah, just just knee, just some knee uh, soreness. Is it serious or? Do uh, we don't think so. I mean, we f he's feeling a little bit better today, and uh, we'll just take it one day at a time. Is, does it continue to be gratifying? You were pretty solid last week, Matt Barkley, and you mentioned tonight too. Uh, to see, to know that you again, it looks like you have you have that number two spot in good hands. Yeah, it's good. It's you know, it's good to have Matt. Um, I really appreciate not only the way he played, but his. His leadership on this football team and the way he works, uh, his work with Josh and, and Ty, and um, you know that's as I mentioned last week, that's an important piece, right? Is is uh, that backup quarterback position, and um, he's done a real nice job to this point. Yeah, I thought line of scrimmage wise, we did a good job. Um, we were active up front uh, on the defensive front, and then the offensive. I thought the offensive line did a good job of establishing the line of scrimmage early in the game, whether it's run or pass game in this case, and, um, and that's important to our success. And um, got our hands up on defense, got our hand, hands on a couple balls, and so um, you know, good to see. A lot of work though to do. Yeah, you know that was part of the uh, plan was to take a look at some of those guys um, and, and see what uh, they could do, and, and I thought we we uh, you know achieved some of our goal of watching them, watching them play with Matt, uh, some of them with Josh. So um, I was I was happy to see Duke play strong and Isaiah, and, and so there's some there's some good competition there. Yeah. Roster six three two something. That's the kind of 
That's right. Yeah, that's right. And another young player, you know, um, that, that made a big, big time contribution tonight. You could feel him. I mean, he, he flashed and I think he did some good things in the run game blocking as well. I mean, it's not just what you do catching the football, but it's being a team player and, and how willing are you to to uh, to block when uh, when you get a block. Yeah, I mean that was big. I mean covering that punt, I know, you know, you never know what happens. They get, you know, get a good return there, and the game's, you know, is what it is. And we covered a good punt. Ray Ray did a nice job, and then the heads up—it was really a heads up play at the end. I mean, not fielding that punt, he was just on top of it situationally. If we field that punt, um, fair catch it, you know, then, you know, we can't run the clock out necessarily there, and just just smart situational football for a young player. Yeah, I mean that and a, and a little bit of, hey, you know, we had some guys not play tonight offensively with, with JB there, so we were able to move some of those guys up and then, and then you know, it was kind of a chain reaction and we moved some of the other guys up to play with Matt. So it was both really, yeah. Christian, you don't play football much, but something good. Man, I'll, <laughs> that would have been his what? His, was that his second touch of his yeah, career? First pass. Oh, man. Down to the one yard line? Yeah. Awesome. Awesome, man. <laughs> I could feel the sideline like about like a tidal wave about to just come over me, you know, and um, you know, so that was another special moment for for Christian and our team. Sean, it was only three days of football, so without getting carried away, but have you learned anything about your team since you made the trip to Carolina? Yeah, I mean, I, I think this is a good group of guys, and it's not that's not new to me. It's um, we've got a group of guys that love to play ball. Um, they love to be around each other, um, um, and they're committed to working hard. Uh, again, it's not that I didn't know that before, but it was it was a, reaffirmed for me on this trip. And um, you know, we did some neat things. We stopped for stopped for ice cream on the way up on the buses yesterday off of the off of the highway, and and those guys loved it. They just appreciated it, and um, it was good to see them again hang out together. And and uh, that's that's how you, part of the way you build a team is that cohesiveness and that chemistry. What flavor did you get? <laughs> it was a great. It was at uh, at Lemons. Uh, I think it was 485 on the way up here. Uh, I had peach. Yeah, it was it was awesome. And I, a couple of guys said it's the best milkshake they've ever had. All right, thanks, guys.